Welcome back to Tenorshare. The iOS 18 public beta is finally here. Want to dive into the new features, but want a more stable experience? Now's the perfect time. You can customize your iPhone in more ways than ever and get a more superb experience with the new iOS 18 feature. But that's not all. There are plenty of other new features and improvements that make this beta more stable and fun to use. I've already get the public beta on my phone, so let me guide you on how to get the public beta quickly and easily. Let's jump right in. Applying for the iOS 18 public beta is straightforward. First, ensure you have a stable internet connection, then open Safari and go to beta.apple.com. You can use this site to apply for the public beta version. Once you're on the Apple beta software program page, scroll down and you can either sign up or sign in with your Apple ID. I'll click sign in since I already have an Apple ID. Log in your Apple ID and you'll be taken to the guide page. Here you can also get the latest public beta versions on your iPad or Mac and Apple TV. Just sign in with the same Apple ID on your other devices will be okay. Back to iOS 18. Scroll down to the Get Started section and click on Enroll your iOS device. On the Enroll page, scroll to the Open Beta Updates option and click it. This will take you directly to the Software Update page in your system settings and show you the latest 18 public beta. Then you can upgrade your phone to the public beta now. If iOS 18 public beta is not showing, close settings in your background first and then reopen it to check for software updates again. The iOS 18 public beta will be available. The beta system may not be stable to use, so I recommend you back up your data in iTunes before you install the iOS 18 beta. This will help a lot if you want to downgrade back to iOS 17.5. If you're unable to apply for the beta program with your ID or want the fastest way to upgrade your phone without getting stuck on the download or installation pages, you can use Reiboot to quickly upgrade or downgrade your phone. It has various iOS packages, including the newest beta versions, so you can update your phone without any trouble. Just in several minutes, you can have iOS 18 on your phone now. If you find the beta version too buggy, just back up your data and downgrade back to iOS 17.5 with Rei Boot. Check out the link in the description if you are interested. Alright, if you get the iOS 18 public beta on your phone, Leave a comment about what you like most or share any bugs and issues you encounter. We're here to help. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and happy upgrading.